girl caught between the family who adopted her and the father who never knew she was given up for adoption. ABC's Amy Robach is here with that. Good morning, Amy. George, good morning to you. It is an incredibly difficult and emotional custody case. It's a battle between a biological father who never knew what happened to his child and the family who desperately wants to continue raising the little girl they love and legally adopted. This little girl is at the center of a fierce fight between a biological father and her adoptive parents. And this morning, both sides are digging in to keep a child they say is theirs. The girl's biological father, Terry Achan, a staff sergeant in the Army, says he never even knew he had a daughter. Nearly two years ago, while he was stationed in South Carolina, he says his now ex-wife, Tira Bland, gave birth in Utah and they gave up the child for adoption without his knowledge or permission. She has a right to be able to be with her father, and that was taken away. Achan's attorney says Bland, the girl's birth mother, intentionally gave the adoption agency the wrong address to reach him, preventing him from asserting his parental rights. Experts say Utah's adoption laws are less strict than other states. For whatever reasons, Utah's laws appeal to people who want to get it done quick rather than people who want to get it done right. Achan's little girl was adopted by Jared and Christy Fry, a Utah couple who wanted to expand their family. The toddler, who turns two in March, has been with them since her birth. But two weeks ago, a judge ordered the Fry's to return the child to Achan within 60 days, and the clock is now ticking. He has that fundamental right to be able to raise his own child. They can help if they want to, or they can be a hindrance. It's really up to them. The Fries appear ready to fight. In a statement to ABC News, their attorneys say they believe the district court made some fundamental errors in its decision, and they will raise those with the appropriate appellate court. Meantime, Achan says he will do what it takes to keep his daughter. And we reached out to the birth mother but never heard back. The next hearing in this case is scheduled for January 16th. Um, I'm not understanding why this is taking so long my opinion of this case the mother should go to jail the adoptive parents should uh, basically sue her for whatever they can get the adoptive parents also need to go and find another child that is in need of a home and in need of a family to uh, love them and the father should automatically get his child back without having to wait any longer uh, for goodness sake, the man was in the army. He was in the service during the time that his daughter was even born. Uh, I just think this case is is a mess. And the wife, the ex-wife, uh, it seems as if she's extremely bitter that you will go through all of this trouble to hurt this man. And I think that's some of the reasons why a lot of black people, well, a lot of black women are considered uh, bitter and upset and evil black women. She did what she did, in my opinion, to hurt her ex-husband. And she didn't think about this child when she did that. So, yeah, I feel she should get some type of jail time. And I feel that... The adoptive parents should sue her for whatever they can get, even though um, that's probably not what's on their mind in the first place is to sue her. They probably want to keep the baby more than actually getting revenge on the, the wife. But uh, yeah, this man should have his daughter back ASAP.